3,000 vaccinated migrant workers will also be allowed into the community per day from the 3rd of December. Currently, the workers are only allowed weekly visits. With the expansion of this program, there will be no limits on the locations the workers can visit. Each visit is capped at eight hours. At the moment, the workers are only allowed to make weekly community visits to Little India and Gela. Precautions like pre-event testing before they leave their dormitories remain in place. The relaxing of restrictions for dorm workers comes after a review of the dormitory ecosystem, according to the authorities. Now, the workers' movement were restricted when thousands of COVID-19 cases emerged in the dorms last year. The large number of infections also highlighted the cramped conditions in the dorms. Deborah Wong again with more. Manpower Minister Tan Si Leng says his ministry has worked with NGOs, associations and industry leaders to study the critical issue of ventilation, dorm layout and communal facilities. Last year, MOM announced that new large quick build dormitories will have improved housing conditions. Now, this could include more isolation facilities and fewer beds in a room to space out workers better. As of Monday, Dr Tan updated that there are 16 quick build dormitories at 11 locations. Four have been repurposed into onboarding centres for migrant workers coming from overseas. Now, this really is a large-scale transformation, so it will take time, but with the greater aim of allowing migrant workers more mobility.